Okay, here we are with a peculiar instrument. This is a Phillips 427 bare bones uh, belt drive. Had an issue with it being a little bit too fast on the RPMs. And there is no speed control on here. And reducing the AC input by up to 30 volts doesn't change the motor speed whatsoever. So it's some kind of synchronous inside the motor. So I poked around on the internet and somebody suggested changing the belt size down just a little bit as far as diameter goes and maybe total length. So the original belt spec'd out was a 15 inch round by about uh, 40 or 50 thick. And what I have on there right now is a 13.6 square belt and a slightly uh, thinner than the original. And I've actually been able to make it back off by a couple of RPM and get pretty close. You can see that outer ring there. And that's the 33. So it's not perfect, but it's slower than it was when it was chipmunking. So... If you ever want to do that on one of these cheap units, you can try that. Take care.